Okay, on this uh, winterization video, we're going to be uh, winterizing this starboard engine uh, during the video, and obviously, uh, we'll do the same thing to the port uh, engine, but we'll only be describing the starboard one in this video. Uh, normally, on each side of the the boat, they have these uh, flushing attachments, where you can they have an adapter that plugs into here that you can hook up a regular uh, garden hose to. Uh, this boat owner does not have the adapter to go in there. Uh, so we uh, chased the plumbing down and we hooked up our own hose shown right here uh, with a, a standard garden hose in plug here which we're going to uh, go ahead and run uh, hooked up to our fresh water um, and run the fuel stabilization or the fuel stabilizer through uh, uh, up to the engine to stabilize the fuel on the on the uh, in the fuel system on the engine okay now that we've got our starboard engine hooked up uh, to our garden hose we're going to go ahead and start that engine and you want to be very cautious uh, you want to make sure the engine is started and uh, running before you supply the water to it uh, because that the the, the water uh, can backfill and flood the engine so we're going to go ahead and start the engine and I've got someone that's going to uh, turn on the water as soon as it starts <laughs> Okay, by the book with Yamaha, uh, you are done. Uh, they recommend after running it for 15 seconds, um, uh, they say that that pushes all the water out of the exhaust. Um, but for this engine here, we're going to go ahead and flush, flush it the rest of the way out with uh, uh, propylene glycol, uh, RV antifreeze, uh, the pink antifreeze that's environmentally friendly. We've got a, a tank here with antifreeze in it see the hose here hooked up to the same hose uh, that we had the fresh water hooked up to uh, so we're going to run this through it and then we're going to run the engine uh, for about 15 seconds more and, and flush it the rest of the way out <laughs> Okay, the last thing to do is to fog the engine. Uh, you'll have to remove this cover here by sliding back all of these latches here and taking these two screws out. Next thing to do is take some type of fogging oil and spray it into each cylinder for three seconds and then it says to start the engine and run it for 15 seconds.